Hey everybody, it's Dekinosai here with another episode of Sudden Colors. In the last episode, we cleared through several levels, one of which is the easiest level in the game. It's that S1 with all the rings around it. It's pretty, pretty, pretty straightforward. Again, if you want to have a chill level to play through in Sonic, that's the level for you. Anyhow, we're going to go through Act 6 now and then potentially a boss. Pretty fun. I actually spoiled this episode last episode, <laughs> this act last episode, but it's another roller coaster episode. Roller coaster level, I should say. I keep calling levels episodes, episode levels. I'm pretty bad about that. I keep calling rings, coins, etc. Jump! I like things like that, especially when it does transitional effects just like that. And I. Please don't tell me this is a failed effort. There we go. Give me asteroids. Dead asteroids. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Give me that spring. Mm. Get me in that roller coaster. Oh yeah. I love physics like this. I love game mechanics just like this. Get me in there. There we go. Where am I going? Where am I? I don't even see me. Oh, I'm, I'm floating now. Now I'm floating. Don't try to catch me if... <laughs> Alright. Enough of that. Boom! I see what you did there, silly man, silly man, trying to kill me with spikes. Who does that in a Sonic game? For real. <laughs> oh, snap. Where am I? I don't even... S I'm so small right now that I don't even see myself. Well, I was, at least. And I know there's a red ring there. I don't want to bother getting it, though, because spikes are pretty boss, if I do say so myself. Rise! Rise, Sonic, rise! That's pretty cool, actually, how they suspended the water right there. I like when games do that, because it's awesome. I wonder what this does underwater. Nothing. It does nothing underwater. It does absolutely nothing underwater. I, I clearly messed that up. Okay, then. Duly noted. Are you sure? Like, what do I do with this? Nothing. I don't do anything with that underwater. Okay, then. Alright. Uh, someday I will figure this out. Someday. But not today. And eventually these swordfish will cut through my bones. Don't die, Sonic. It's not worth it. Don't be a hero. Sonic Heroes. Yeah. Nom it! Nom it! Aw. So close and yet so far away. Sorry I'm being silent, I'm just focusing on what I'm supposed to be doing here. Nom it! Eat it! Eat it all! Cho'Gath eats the world, yo! I'm gonna call this guy Cho'Gath from now on. He's like a mantis kind of kind of thing from League of Legends. I don't think it's a mantis. He's more like just a giant tarantula bug or something. I don't even know. I'm probably horrendously misnaming the animal, and I apologize to any League of Legends fans out there. I don't play Cho'Gath that much, so I just know the way he looks, and he's a pretty cool gentleman. That was a black hole. I'm pretty sure this is mini boss material. Yeah, that's some mini boss material. So what up, Doogie Hauser? I have to concentrate and find the holes in his seam before it's too late. Oh, it's just going faster now. Uh... Cool. All right. Please blow up. Thank you. As long as it's not all over me, you know. I don't mind if you explode anywhere else. Just not on me. Sounds so dirty. Cool. So out of that, we got a B. A B! Ah! <laughs> oh, God. Sorry. I'm, I'm an old-time uh, Nintendo Capri Sun watcher. Like, I I used to watch Nintendo Capri Sun a lot, and I kind of pick up on some of his things every now and then. 
So then, Mr. Boss Man, dude, person, guy, thing, fish, let's see what you got. You know, I don't like what you're doing to my friends in there. It's messed up, so I'm gonna mess you up. Yeah, that's right, I'm stretching. You got a problem with that? I want to be able to fully enjoy taking you apart without some pooled muscle slowing me down. Okay, now I'm ready. Of course, if you want to run away, please feel free. There's no shame in it. Well, maybe a little shame. You guys don't talk much, do you? Fair enough. Don't say I didn't warn you. Alright, so what's this boss gonna be like? Oh, it's one of those again. Oh my god. <laughs> it's one of these bosses. It's this guy. He's back. He's back for more action. Let's hope I don't uh, die 5,000 times on this guy again. I should probably target one of the... Whoa! Whoa, dude. What's going... Oh, okay. It's like a hyperspace black hole or something. Yeah, that probably hurts if you're uh, falling through an... What? Oh, they remade this boss and it's different move sets and everything. So confusing. Seriously. Chase that ship down and start Don't be surprised when it works. Find it again and blam Alright. I will do my breast. I really want to take down one of those like side engines. That's what I want to do. Can I do this? Oh, it's not even. Whatever. Let's do this, Leroy! Alright, so he's warped out of hyperspace now, so. This should be interesting, to say the least. Alright, so I avoided that. Now, can I avoid drowning? That is the question. Alright. So I, I narrowly evaded its missiles. So I know how to dodge that phase now. Now I just need to catch back up with it and uh, avoid the, the giant rocks floating towards me. It's easier in first person perspective though. So 3D, yeah, I can do that. Cool, rocket, huh? Why would they give me rocket though? Sorry about that minor interruption. Part of what I live with these days. I thought I broke that gun. Oh well, I'll just break the back engine or something. There we go. Hopefully it can't warp again. Though it's probably gonna warp now. Oh, no warping, I see. On the other hand, it's more like uh... <laughs> There we go. There we go. Break it more. Break it. Oh yeah. There we go. Ooh, last wins, I see. So many rings, so little time. Can I break this? Yes, I can! Awesome! I want to actually try to use rocket one time on this, though. Like, why did they give me rocket? Why give me rocket if I can't do anything with it, you know? Oh, God. I fell for the Sonic 2 trap. There's, like, rings, and then there's... What? So it's virtually pointless on this level to get rocket. Okay, noted. And it's warping again. All right. So it seems it has a mini Stargate projector or something. Who knows? Nobody knows. Let's see. All right, I have to avoid all the gunfire. There's nothing I can do about this stage. Oh, it sounded like I lost rings, but I didn't. There we go. There we go, I avoided everything. Now I just have to finish this fight once and for all. Because I know it's on its last legs now. So I can't give it up from here. Just a little bit longer. Again, why the rocket? Why rocket? Come on, blow up, blow up. Throw rings everywhere. I just collected all those rings and now I'm on my last limb. Great. Die, monster! You don't belong in this world! 
Take one up, thank you. Now if I somehow get hurt at the ending cutscene for this boss, it's okay, it's okay. The thing is, how is it gravitating downward? It's in space. You can't gravitate you can't gravitate downward in space. And there's nothing to gravitate towards. I'm thinking too deep into this. <laughs> I know, but still. Just a little bit more. Give me that one up. Aw. 506, that's what I uncovered. That was almost difficult. Sonic, you did it! Couldn't have done it without you, buddy. Thanks. Hey, we both deserve some kind of reward. Yeah, let's go to an amusement park or something. All right, but uh, one that's, you know, less evil than this one. <laughs> <laughs> so, are all the aliens getting free? Looks like it. Once the power went off, the locks vanished. I hope Yakker's okay. I think you'll be fine. You don't think the weapon you were shot with still works? Not without power flowing to it. I think we're all good. That's what I like to hear. destroyed, we can blow this joint and head home. We did it, dude. We? I don't remember you fighting off any insane robots. True. Well, good job to you on inventing a translator that allowed us to speak to the aliens and figure out exactly what we needed to do so we weren't running around the park looking like idiots. <laughs> I kind of did that anyways, though. That was me. Hmm. Good point. Either way, we can get out of this crazy place and go home. <laughs> Looks like the aliens are happy to be going home, too. Uh, I think we're in the middle of a party. The middle? We are the party. I think we're their guests of honor. Totally. That spinning break dance. All right, so it seems we've unlocked this portion of the uh, station. Nobody knows exactly what that does. I guess it takes us back to the Earth. But anyways, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, please consider leaving a like as it will help other people find my videos and thus maybe make this my career. I am doing a two-year Let's Play challenge, so um, I'll be posting a Let's Play episode once a day, every day until April 27th, 2015. Thank you very much for watching. Take it easy and decky harder. Next stop, critical system failure. Repeat, critical system failure.